Oh, to love what is lovely and will not last. Those are the first lines of a poem by Mary Oliver, an appropriately titled poem, Snow Geese. And those words certainly ring true, given what was sent to our Idaho Weather Watchers Facebook page. Denise posted this photo earlier this week with the caption, The skies over Parma filled with snow geese, tundra swans, and sandhill cranes this time of year. That's a lot of birds. Dark in the sky a bit, huh? Tens of thousands of them. Sign of the times, even during a pandemic, birds of a, fe of a feather, even those of not a feather, they flock together in a spring migration from the south. Photojournalist Kevin Esslinger went west to find them. They arrive in clusters, landing in Idaho, usually the latter half of February. Snow geese, mostly white with black tipped wings, delivering a layer of drenched down and dissonance to the Roswell Marsh wildlife habitat. They may be known as lesser snow geese because of their smaller size, but that has little to do with their large numbers. Every year, upwards of 60,000 waterfowl will make this part of Parma their home for a few late winter weeks. A bull-rushed rest area along the Pacific Flyway. A major migratory corridor that will take these geese all the way from California to northern Canada. And while they're here, bird watchers will take full advantage. Oh my God. Knowing full well. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. They'll soon fill up the sky and fly on again. Crazy. There was a time when the snow geese population was threatened and hunting them was actually stopped from 1916 to 1975. Since then, their populations have continued to grow to the point of millions. They are now the most abundant waterfowl on the continent. But that has meant bad news for breeding grounds. Too many geese getting together for, uh, well, that could lead to tearing up the tundra. So yes, you can hunt these snow geese. It helps control the population, just can't do it at the Roswell habitat. And only for five more days, the hunting season in Idaho ends March 10th.